a FIFA 13 squad builder and um, it's going to be a Russian league team and so I'll get straight into it our keeper is going to be Dikan plus for Spartak Moscow he's got A1 diving, A4 reflexes and 82 positioning he's, oh, he's alright, I haven't I don't think he's that good, he's got good stats but he just doesn't do very good in game but you can get Akin Thief if you have the coins but I'm not going to spend that many coins on Akin Thief because like 15k so Dickhan will do, he's the best keeper beside Akin Thief stat wise so that's alright, we'll move on to our right back we've got Angwa the only silver of this team and the most expensive player of this team he got me 15k which is a lot but he's got 89 pace which is all that really matters and that's what we want that's why we paid 15k for him and um, if you don't want to get him you can get Anyakov or there's a Brazilian right back but I wanted Angwa because of his pace so it's a bit expensive but oh well I don't mind our first centre back is going to be Uberchan he used to be a non rare left back silver non rare left back in FIFA 12 now he's gone up to a gold and he's a centre back now he's got 77 pace 78 defending 73 heading which is the pace is really good which is why I've got him in there and um, he only cost me 450 coins but all these, the old, most of these players all their prices have gone skyrocketed they've all gone really high so you're going to have to pay a bit more for him now but he's very good 77 pace next centre back is going to be Bocchetti he's another fast one he's got 76 pace 71 defending at 80 heading he's a beast I like Bocchetti a lot he's very very good um, yeah we'll move on to our left back we've got Ansaldi 87 pace all that really matters all we really want and care about in a left back. He only cost me a K, but now in a 4 you're going to have to pay a lot more than a K. You're going to have to pay about 6K or something like that. I bought most of these players. I bought basically all these players except for Anva and my striker that I'm going to put here like as soon as the web app came out, so they're really cheap, and now they've gone up in price up by a lot. Okay, we on to our centre defensive mid. We've got Rasmus Alm. Scary fuck, look at him, oh my god. That's fucking disgusting. But anyway, enough about his head, he's got 65 pace, which is pretty disappointing. But oh well, we have to live with it. He's pretty good, it's just the pace. Lost. He's just lost by the team. But he's got 82 passing and a 76 shot. He's got a pretty good shot. But yeah, he's decent. He's pretty cheap actually. 850 coins, you can get him for around that now. He hasn't gone up at all. And I think he hasn't gone up because he's 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 because his pace is a good pace. Anyway, we'll move on to our right mid. We have got Aiden McGeady. Ninety-one pace, eighty-six dribbling, and a seventy-one shot. He's got five-star skills. He's a beast. He's very very good. Got him for two point eight k. You're gonna have to pay a lot more than that now, but he's very very good. Aiden McGeady, plus the Spartak Moscow. We'll move on to our left mid. We've got Gonzalez. 90 pace, again, very fast, that's what we would like to see. So he had dribbling and an 80 shot, he's got a very good shot, he's got 4 star weak, 4 4 star skills, left footer, 1.3k I paid for him, again, I'm pretty sure his price has gone up a bit since then. Um, yeah, We'll move on to our cam, we've got Kasuki Honda, he's got very good stuff, 82 pace, 81 dribbling and an 81 shot. He's, he's a beast, he's got a great, great left foot and a great right foot, he's got a four star weak foot. Um, you can get um, Danny or Carlos Eduardo if you want to, but I prefer I prefer um, Honda, because he's got a very good shot. I mean, Carlos Eduardo, he's got five star skills and I'm not much of a skiller, so I, I like Honda. He's more of a beast player. Our first striker is going to be Obafemi Martins. This guy is amazing. This guy's oh, he's so good. He's got five star weak foot, ninety pace. I mean, oh, he's so overpowered, but he's a beast. Cost four point three k. I bought him yesterday. He's why well, him and Angwa the only players I bought yesterday. And um, yeah, he's he's so overpowered. He's a beast. As you can see, two games played, six goals scored. And he's and I played against friends as well. He's so overpowered. 
and our next, our last player is going to be Zaydu Dumbia. He's got 91 pace, 85 dribbling, and a 78 shot. He's a very, very good player as well. Played with him a lot in FIFA 12, and he's in form in FIFA 12 as well. He's very, very fast, as like um, Femi Martins, and he's got four star weak foot too, which is pretty good. And yeah, he's very, very good. Played 2.2k. You're gonna pay a lot more for him now, but yeah, he's still very good. You, if you want, you can get like MNEK or Wellington as you, uh, as your two strikers, but they're a lot more expensive. They're like 10k each, and Wellington like 18k, especially in 4 and 2 and 2. Or you can get Eto if you have a lot of coins. But uh, I actually do have a lot of coins, but I um, don't really want to spend it. I like these two up front. And um, we just put our manager in. Who have we got? We got Di Matteo. And um, yeah, so this is the squad, very base squad, very pacey, very, very, very good. Uh, not very expensive except for Angba, but now it's a bit more expensive than it used to be. But yeah, very overpowered squad. Thanks for watching, guys.